R. Lee Army, Full Metal Jacket Sergeant, dies at 74 R. Lee Army will best be remembered for playing hard-nosed military men throughout his acting career, such as Gunnery SGT. Hartman in Stanley Kubrick's Full Metal Jacket. Army died Sunday from pneumonia-related complications, according to his longtime manager Bill Rogan. Army was 74. Rogan wrote on Army's Twitter account, It is with deep sadness that I regret to inform you all that are. Lee Army, the gunny, passed away this morning from complications of pneumonia. He will be greatly missed by all of us. Semper Fi, Gunny. Godspeed. Army was no stranger to military life. He was a U.S. Marine Corps Staff Sergeant and an Honorary Gunnery Sergeant. He also served as a drill instructor for the Marines. Army served 14 months in Vietnam and completed two tours in Okinawa, Japan. The Hollywood Reporter writes Army took up acting after retiring from the military with 11 years of service under his belt. Army took some acting classes and was cast in one of his first roles, playing a helicopter pilot in 1979's Apocalypse Now, and also serving as a technical advisor to director Francis Ford Coppola on the film. Another role he landed around that same time also hit close to home, playing a marine drill instructor in Sydney Fury's The Boys in Company C but it was his role in Kubrick's 1987 film Full Metal Jacket that brought him household recognition and critical acclaim, in addition to his Golden Globe nom. He also earned a Best Supporting Actor award from the Boston Society of Film Critics. He is probably best remembered for the numerous memorable lines he delivered as the no-nonsense sergeant, including, What is your major malfunction, num nuts? Didn't mommy and daddy show you enough attention when you were a child? The Associated Press reports the part Ermi would become most well-known for, in Full Metal Jacket, wasn't even originally his. Army had been brought on as a technical consultant for the 1987 film, but he had his eyes on the role of the brutal gunnery sergeant and filmed his own audition tape of him yelling out insults while tennis balls flew at him. An impressed Kubrick gave him the role. Kubrick Rick told Rolling Stone that 50% of Ermi's dialogue in the film was his own. In the course of hiring the Marine recruits, we interviewed hundreds of guys. He also played track and field coach and Nike co-founder Bill Powerman in Prefontaine, General Kramer in Toy Soldiers and Mayor Tillman in Mississippi Burning. Ermi also hosted the History Channel series Mail Call and Lock and Load with R. Lee Ermi and was a board member for the National Rifle Association, as well as a spokesman for Glock, 